Alright, today I'm going to do a simple tu tutorial about how to clone yourself with uh, Adobe Premiere Pro. And this one's set up to, you know, kind of really focused towards beginners, so it's going to be real simple. Uh, once you have Premiere Pro open, go down to your import media. And I actually have a video I shot just kind of playing around. Uh, I put it in a folder called Clone and what I did is I went ahead and set the camera up in a controlled environment so lighting nothing was going to change on me because if I was going to shoot this outdoors then I would have to go ahead and start doing adjustments to keep the lighting the same um, but because this is just a real simple one I'm going to show you how I did it um, basically I went ahead and I started recording and let's see about the time I sit down we could probably go ahead and cut in and I'm going to run across I don't know we'll grab 50 seconds and I'm just gonna go ahead and take the video only because dog was barking in the background and we'll go ahead and move up here to when I switch sides so we'll pick that as an endpoint and we'll go I don't know right about there is good and once again we'll go ahead and drag the video only and they don't match up but that's no big deal we'll fix that in a minute now what you want to do is go over to your effects and you can type in and use the crop tool just take the crop tool drag it drop it right on the top layer and then you come up here to your effects controls and because this is a very simple one I mean we can use the pen tool over you know, the eclipse mask all kinds of stuff but this one's really easy so we'll just use the full point mask and what I'm going to do is just split it right down between the light. So I'll drag this all the way down to the bottom, over to the side. Let's see if I can grab this one and get it over. And that's it. But you know, if we had other things we needed to split, we can sit there and use the pen tool and mask all around it. And then what I want to do is come over here and I want to move the mask to the right a little bit. And I always have trouble doing this with the mouse. see if I can get it this time so you can see as I move the mask what I want to do is get right about in the center there and even though I didn't move you really can't see the line but I'm just gonna go ahead and feather this out I usually set it about 15 17 and now if you play it you can see it looks like you're sitting at the table eating with yourself so from this point you can just run it to whatever point you want to cut I'm going to go ahead and grab your slice tool and cut it delete the last parts and then go ahead and send it out to render but basically you just created a video and I use this on Facebook as a joke said I ordered one of those do it your home do it yourself at home clone kits so I didn't have to eat alone when my wife was out shopping <laughs> so uh, it's real simple, but you know you can play with it and you can make it as difficult or as easy as you like You can just kind of plan it out or like in this case I just used really Simple setup where I didn't have to worry about dealing with lighting conditions anything else I put the dog in the other room so that he couldn't be running through and messing it up but uh, I'm gonna be doing some more uh, tutorials just on uh, the Adobe products that I like and that I use and I'm mainly going to focus them towards beginners so if you like the video be sure to comment subscribe give me a thumbs up and I uh, hope to see you guys in the future hope you have a great day bye